So let's come on here and check out the changes I made in the power line today. What was it? Christmas Day? Wednesday? December 25th, 2019. So, got our recloser pole. We got our three phase 7200 going to single phase 7200. When we come over here, we got our what? 12470 insulator. 12,470 volt insulator. Neutral up on the arm. Come over here, we got our 13,800 up here. With our neutral up there. Tell you what, that's a different kind of neutral spool insulator. Not the usual type. And then you come over here, we got 7200. So we got an example of our thing. Got our 7200 coming down here. 12240. Got your electric fence, which are straightened some wires. And I tell you what, like the power company, I think I need to come right here. Put like a model wall of a house, about eight foot tall, little servant sensors on it. We can demonstrate that. Still put my guy wire on it though. He should lean that far because that's not a big run. Travel out chairs and our what? New sleezer, Adirondacks, and wire stable here. Got that insulator up there. Got your ground there coming down. And, uh, actually, these should have the buck ground, but those ones have a ground rod. Come up here. Got our Western Union splices up there. Got our 14,000 volt fuse up there. K1 insulator. Right here. So we got our hydro, geothermal, oil, nuclear, methane. Got our coal fire. Got our YouTube signs there. Gotta fix this ground rod. It's hideous. Got a recloser pole here, bypass fuse, double lightning arresters for each line, cable clamp, everything, neutral spool, all the wire spooled tight all the way. So I think we're good to go for one now. Go put the guy wire on here. I think it'll affect that bone. So we got everything we need out here. 